Ah, good day everyone, and welcome to today's One Life episode. So last episode, we were on the quest to find two Notch Apples so we could complete our advanced Nether Star store. And guess what? We have completed that. We got the sword. It's everything. It's gorgeous. Um, but we haven't been able to test it out on proper enemies. So uh, I just got a message uh, right here. Where is it? Right there, the blood moon is rising. So we are gonna go out and kill some bad guys. So let's go in our front yard and let's go destroy them with one hit wonders. Oh, I'm so excited. We haven't added any advancements on it yet, um, but we will, don't you worry. Hello, care to die? Death be with you and death also be with you. Hiya! Oh, it feels so good! Oh gosh, people with the damn thing. Okay, so clearly it works very well. It works wonders, in fact. Um, hello, you need to go away. Don't you take my torches down? How dare you? Oh, it just works so well. Okay, so that's an example of it. Um, Oh my gosh, there's bad guys in here. Hello, who let you in here? Wow. Okay, well, um, I think I'm gonna make a day. We've clearly seen that the sword works very well, but um, I just wanna make a day. And then I'm gonna work on all the advancements for the sword and we are going to upgrade this to the extreme maximum. Let's just take a look at what we can do for upgrades. So for one, we are going to do sharpness upgrades. We're also going to do some smite, I think. Oh, oh my, we need skeleton skulls and zombie heads. I don't think we have any zombie heads. Bane of anthropods, we could probably do that. Knockback level two, we can definitely do that. Elite knockback, wow. Oh, we're gonna need lots of slime blocks, okay. Fire aspect for sure. Oh, we're gonna need blaze rods. Okay, so we have a lot to do this episode. I'm very excited. Let's just don't go away. No, 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 no. Okay. Wow, it's so bloody and moony outside. Let's make that day, shall we? We certainly shall. Ah, good day, everyone. <laughs> gonna head back home and then we'll work on the advancements first thing i want to do is probably just the sharpness one so for that uh which we've done before we just need flints we need iron swords and we need diamond swords and prismary charts so how many of those are we gonna need we're gonna need four levels that's six seven eight nine and ten we might need five i don't know Let's see how many prismarine shards we have. I'm wondering if we should also just place it in the enchanting table and just see what it gets by itself. That way we're not starting from scratch on everything. It can kind of just do its thing and then we can add on to it. Alrighty, let's see. You can't even enchant it. You can't. Wait, can you add upgrades to it then? I wonder. Let's see, do we have any leftovers? Oh, they're falling, um... Okay, yeah, so you can add stuff to it. I guess you just can't enchant it for some reason. Maybe the enchanting table just doesn't know. So I guess what we could do is enchant books and then upgrade the books? I don't know, let's just see. Okay, I'm gonna go through this and I'm gonna see if we can make the most upgrades possible. Okay, so I've upgraded one book in particular to be a super book. So it has Bane of Anthropods 4, or yeah. So that basically is good against spiders. Sweeping Edge, I don't really know what that does. I think it just makes your like sweep faster or bigger. I don't know. Knockback 2, which obviously pushes them back further, and Fire Aspect 1. So let's um, add these in. It's gonna cost me quite a bit of levels, I'm sure. So let's see. This is it. Let's add it. 25 levels. My goodness, Gracianius. 
So now I'm going to add in some sharpness upgrades, which I've worked on. So I made five of these right there. So this will give us sharpness one, two, three, four, and five. So now we need to do the advanced ones, which I made two of those with the stuff I had. So basically I had to make a bunch of diamond swords and I needed prismarine shards, but I'm out of prismarine shards. So looks like we're going to have to go kill some guardians again, but let's add these two that I made already. So this will get us to level six and seven so now we just need three more levels which requires um four times three is 12 so we need nine more prismarine shards so let's head into the ocean and let's go kill some elder guardians well not elder guardians just guardians in general i think elder is taking it a little too far um but let's see i wonder if i can one hit them with a sword that will be so cool if I could just be like, swing. Oh, let's see what my attack power is, by the way. With the sharpness, it's 64 now. Originally, it was 60. So that's cool. It's already gone up four dot, four, four numbers, whatever that is. Oh, I haven't seen any updates with Yemi's Amusement Park. I still want to make Joey's Jungle Cruise. Whoa! This carousel. I think this is Marielle's. It is. Whoa, this is so cool. Okay, let's hop on. Come on, let's go. Oh, I guess you can't. You can't move. Maybe I, you push it and then hop in. Yeah, let's try that. Here, move, piggy. Uh-oh. Okay, well, that's not working. Um, I think there's also a Ferris wheel, which I think is shovels, but let's check in and see if I'm correct. Oh, I don't think, is it open yet? Yes, I'm gonna say yes it is. There's a bed here. Oh, all right, start it up. Let's go. <laughs> Must be it broken or shut down. I don't know. Let's go kill some guardians. Alrighty, land ho. And by land ho, I mean ocean ho. Oh, there's a hole down here. Let's see what this is. Is this a crystal cave? It sure is. Any bad guys down here? Oh, I thought there would have been some things. Okay. Well, let's break in, shall we? Ah, oh, hello, baby creeper. Yes, I killed you in one swipe. Swipe or no swiping. Swipe or no swiping. Doesn't seem like there's any diamonds down here. Just some emeralds, which I have tons of. So, oh, there's some diamonds. Don't mind if I do. <gasps> Tis the guardian! Oh, die! Oh no, wait, did I hit him? I don't know, I just know I need to get to the surface. Oh, phew, okay, let's go down there. Oh, I can't see anything, it's so dark. Okay, we need to make land hoe and sleep on this little island over here, and then we'll kill them. Oh my gosh, there's so many boats over here. Someone must have defeated this a while ago. <laughs> and it had to have been like way before. And think, whoa, what is happening? Who's attacking me? There you are. Let me sleep. There's a guardian over there. Death be with you, sir. And also with you. Yeah. Oh, lots of them. Okay, cool. Haha! -ha! How did that feel? Probably not too good now, did it? Hello. Goodbye. Give me those shards. Chardonnay. Oh, fun. I'm inside this place. Oh, maybe not fun. Kind of scary, but actually kind of better because then I can just whack them. Hello, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. This is very dangerous to be in here, actually. I should probably leave. 
Okay, yeah, I'll leave. Oh no! <laughs> They're stuck in the boat! <laughs> That's so funny. Oops. Okay, wow, I got 24 of these. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna teleport home because that's way quicker. <laughs> ah, feels good to be back. Okay, I'm gonna finish these upgrades and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've made the elite sharpness upgrades, so now let me add the final three to the sword, because we're at seven, eight, nine, and finally, sharpness X. Okay, cool. So now that we have all the sharpness upgrades, it only costs us a bunch of freaking diamonds. Uh, let's see what else we need. So sharpness is done. Smite. Let's see what level we have here. Um, we have no smite. So let's see what that even requires, first of all. Okay, so bone, rotten flesh, and paper. We can get five upgrades real quick. For some reason, it won't let me add a smite book to my enchant, which I don't understand. See, I already have a smite five, and when I try adding it in an anvil, I don't know if you can like only choose that or bane of anthropods, so maybe, uh, yeah. Doesn't seem to work. So I think you can still do a regular upgrade one. Let's find out. So rotten flesh, we have the paper and then bone, I think it was. Yep. So we'll just make one and see if that even works. Okay, moment of truth. It does allow it. Okay, cool. So now we have smite one. So not that we really need it because, well, you don't, but I want to make this fully, like, to the extreme maximum. So we just need four more of those. Okay, we now have Smite B, aka Smite 5. So if we want to do Smite 10, we're going to now need zombie heads, which I, I don't have any of those. All I have is skeleton skulls. How do you even get zombie heads? I have no idea. Yeah, I only have 10 skeleton ones. So we'll skip that upgrade for now. Being of anthropods, what do we have right now? We have four. So I think this can get us up to five. So we just need spider eye, string, and paper. Okay. Our fifth being of anthropods. Cool. So let's see what that full upgrade would cost. So cobwebs, how the hell do you make a cobweb? Do I have to silk touch? I don't have time to go down and silk touch things. I'm sorry, that's just not happening today. Unless I have some cobwebs, which I don't. So therefore I'm not going and silk touching those. So let's move on to our knockback. So we have no knockback too. I don't know if this is a good idea, because knockback's kind of annoying. So like if you have knockback four, like they're literally gonna be thrown all the way across the world. So I'm just not into it. But fire aspect, we could definitely get into. So we need fire charges and blocks of coal and paper. Coal, we have our paper. We are gonna need these blaze rods for the next thing. And where are the fire charges? Okay, we have two fire aspect upgrades. Let's add those to it. Oh wait, I already have fire aspect two on it. No, I have fire aspect one. Okay, so now I have fire aspect two. I can't add it again for third, but I can use this for the ultimate upgrade. So we'll need two more of these. So that will require a block of coal and four blaze rods. Okay, blaze rods, and then I just need four more blocks of coal, and then we are going to have such a fire-rific sword, my goodness. Okay, so that is now fire aspect three, fire aspect four. What was our old sword? That had fire aspect two. Now it's even better, better, because that has fire aspect four, oh my gosh. Okay, pretty cool. Looting, we don't really need that. Guys, we've done it all. That's all the upgrades for the sword. Holy crap. I think that's the best it can be. I don't know what the sweeping edge is. Like, can you get a sweeping edge too? 
I don't know. Let's actually look that up. One second. Um, the Sweeping Edge Enchantment increases the damage of a sweep attack. You can add Sweeping Edge Enchantment to any sword using... Okay, cool. Can you have Sweeping Edge too? Max level is three. I don't have any more Sweeping Edges, but maybe I could get some books that could have Sweeping Edge. I feel like it's something that you find, though. Sweeping Edge 3, that would be really good. We're gonna have to figure a way to find out how to get those. I think you can just honestly get it from an enchanting table. But we are not in the marketplace to enchant because our levels are so freaking low. Okay, so it is the next day and I've had some inspiration to work on my theme park ride. So what it is that I want to do is create a jungle cruise safari thing. So kind of like a lazy river where people can get in boats and it'll be jungle themed. So we need to see if I have any jungle saplings, which I should have. You go leap it to case. Where's my jungle? Do I not have any jungle? <gasps> right here, 10. Okay, perfection. I'm probably gonna have to chop some of these down to get um, some more saplings, but this is a good start. So we're gonna need a shovel. We're gonna need water. Oh, we should make that infinite water source so I can uh, fill it all up with water. So what was that? It was a water something. What are these? Water stone? How the hell do you make water stone? Where's water stone from? Excuse me, hi. Where do you get water stone? Okay, don't tell me. That's fine. Is this fresh water? What is that? I don't know what that is. Is that someone I'm looking for? There it is, the well. So it's just diorite and iron. That is just so weird that it doesn't even require any water to make this infinite water source. I wish you could do that with uh, the spring water, but sadly, you can't. Maybe it'll work with marble maybe no we'll just use diorite since i saw that oh i love doing that i love getting it wrong oh there we go we have our well let's head on over to the area where i'm thinking of doing this i think it would also be cool if we brought our ocelot that we have and we can cage it up over there so it can kind of feel like it's at home but I am very excited to do this. It will also be really cool. You know what? Maybe I should bring some dirt blocks. Nah, I'll get a bunch when I dig. Diggity dig dig. Like to have a um a cave that you go through with vines and stuff. Oh, I'm just so excited for this. This is gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, I feel like I've been doing a lot of like questing and uh, achievement stuff, but I haven't really, you know, sat back, relaxed, and just did some casual building. So I think that's what we're gonna do for the rest of this app. One day I will have my own baby dragon egg. Until that day, I'm just gonna work on my jungle cruise. Alrighty, let's find ourselves a nice spot for this. Oh wow, this is this is small. <laughs> we're running out of space over here. Um hmm. hmm hmm. Where could this be? I might just have to extend this out. And then I'll just build the cruise over here. We could have a waterfall that goes into this. Okay. Let's see what we have working with. Show me what you're working with. Okay, I say we start... Oh, wait, this is part of CBK's attraction. So let's start it right here. This will be the entrance. And then we can, like, make it go around here. It can go down there. Although, I don't like that it's right next to the water. Hmm. You know what? We're going to make it work. So this is where it's going to start. I'm basically going to take my uh, shovel and map it out. And then once I have it all mapped out, I will catch up with you guys and show you kind of what the trail is going to look like. I think I'll do it by a three by three sized river. This will be the entrance. Okay, cool. Be right back. <sighs> okay, so I've mapped out the path. So people will start here in their boats. I will have like uh, a dispenser that pops out boats. They hop in and then they head this way. They're going to go down a little waterfall thing. Go across here. It's very slow. If I don't have a boat. Oh, I should fill in these holes. Um, and then they go into the cave. Spooky cave. And then they go down another thing. It's kind of like um, the Pirates of the Caribbean ride. So they go down and jump, and then they go through the cave again. Oh my gosh, this block. It's glitchy. 
And then they're gonna have to power up this with uh, their boats, which I think is kind of easy to do. Let's see, extend this out a little. I think you can do this easily on your boat. Hopefully. If not, they're just gonna have to swim. Okay. And then they come up here on their boat and they will be on another straightaway path, just enjoying the scenery. And then they're gonna have to go up this again with water, which I feel like should be easy on a boat. And then they'll go through here and then they'll end right here, get out, and that's that. So let me go in, add a bunch of water, and then we'll come back and we'll test it out with our boat and see if it actually even works. Okay, let's also test out this well. Oh, it does work, that's so cool. It's just like swipey swipe swipe. Here, let me just fill this up. That is so amazing. I'm so glad that I discovered that because this is going to be extremely helpful during this time. Okay, I'm so nervous to test this out because if it doesn't work, then what do we do? You know, we've just kind of made something that just, you know what, it should work. So yeah, you just go in here. Whee! I'm wondering if I should seal that up just so you don't fall through it. Okay, so it's actually really easy to maneuver and then you just steer it, I guess. I don't know how it is going up a river though. Okay, <laughs> so there's our there's our issue. Uh-oh. Let's see, how do we do this? We need to figure out what if we put stairs? Would stairs work? I don't know. Here, let's try this again. Let's um pick up this boat. There we go. So it works going down, but why doesn't it work going up? Alright, come on, let's go. <laughs> I just sink. Okay. Alright, now it's got me trapped. Alright, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to build stairs. I really don't know. I hope that this can work. Otherwise, we're gonna be in trouble. Okay, so. I've been working really hard at making this water elevator thing. It was like a redstone thing. I've honestly been working on this for the past hour and it's just not working. So basically you're supposed to hop onto here and it's supposed to shoot you up to the top. But for some reason it's not shooting up. Oh gosh, I've broken it. This is very, very, very frustrating. And I just want to give up and I think I'm going to. So, uh, basically it's like a, a slime block thing. It works, um, did I break it? No, yes, it did. Okay, I need a string. Um, it like shoots you up into the air. So let's, let's try. Ugh. I think I'm getting caught on something. Ready, look. What am I getting caught on? Is it that dirt? I think it's this dirt maybe. Okay, let's try it now. See? You can see that it kind of works. I think I'm... There we go! See? It works with you, but when it's the boat, it just, like, doesn't shoot you forward. Ready? Here we go! I keep getting caught on something. I think it just doesn't work with this Minecraft version. So, if you're gonna follow a tutorial online, don't do one that's from an older version of Minecraft. I'm done. I'm done with this. This is so freaking frustrating. It took me literally so long to do this and it doesn't even work. So therefore, I'm done with this. And um, we're just gonna go and um, be really sad. And you know what? I forgot that I had things going on up here. I was, um, I had saplings falling that have probably despawned now. Hello? Oh, a devil chicken. Hello. Yeah, that's right. You run. You run too. Death be with you. Okay, let's chop down this tree. Actually, it's kind of pretty. Although we do need more saplings. Um, okay. Rude. Give me saplings. Wow, that was a big tree. I got a lot of logs from that. Um, so because I'm headed on a trip, I'm going to be in Hawaii. I was trying to record some gaming and this is, um, this is what... 
I've been given. This is my luck. I try and start something that I think is going to take only a few minutes and I get sucked into it for an hour. So I'm going to have to work on this another time. If you guys have any suggestions of how to make this uh, water elevator work, please leave it in the comments down below. I really need help. But um, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta catch a flight. So I love you guys. I will see you all tomorrow. I'm not even going to ask you guys to give this a thumbs up because I'm not happy with this episode. But if you did enjoy it, you know, I'm not even going to ask you. But I love you. Tomorrow's episode or next episode will be better. I'm sorry. Bye.